All right, guys, Jeff here with Herbal Healing CBD. Um, been getting a lot of questions about the new website I created, the legal-thc-delta9.com. Um, rightfully so, because what what happened here? What what's going on here? Basically, weed has been legalized in every state in the country. Um, how has this happened? You haven't heard anything on the news about it, of course. Um, so it's kind of happened under the table. So in 2008, they wanted to get a process going where CBD was legal and where hemp was legal and where people could grow hemp, sell hemp use it for products, things of that sort. So 2008, they passed a bill called the 2008 Farm Bill. What this did was made it legal to grow hemp, um, industrial hemp, as long as it did not contain over 0.3% THC. That's your 0.3% THC you see right there. So what is that 0.3%? That's regular THC. Exact same THC grows in the hemp plant that grows in the marijuana plant. Uh, cannabis sativa L is the hemp plant, just a slightly different plant, same THC, less of it, of course. So what the 2008 Farm Bill essentially did is inadvertently legalize THC in, say, certain quantities. So ever since then, the hard stand that THC was illegal, you know, is kind of gone. However, that didn't really do anything for us because everything had to be less than 0.3%, right? So you couldn't smoke a substance that was only 0.3% THC and get any high off of it. Everyone knows, you know, the minimum may be 3% and you could feel something off of it, but that's just the way smoking is. However, if you're eating an edible and you put 0.3% THC in the edible, what do you have? Well, say you have an, an edible that is 100 grams then you have, uh, or say you have an edible that's a thousand milligrams, then you would have three milligrams of THC, right? That legally you could have up to three milligrams of THC. Now we all know the active dose for an edible is around maybe nine milligrams, 10 milligrams. The, the dispensary makes them 10 milligrams because they think that's plenty strong to where people can step up and not freak out by eating one and, and going crazy. So, <clears throat> What do you have to do to make a gummy that's legal that has 10 milligrams of THC? What do you have to do in order to do that? Very simple. You make the gummy 4,000 milligram total instead of the 1,000 milligram total. So what you're doing is you're adding, you're adding dry weight to this gummy that is not THC. The more dry weight you add to this gummy that is not THC, the more THC you can add to the gummy. So this is a never-ending thing here. I can make a gummy that's 100 milligrams of THC. It's going to be a little bit bigger than this, but do, does any of us really care if we have an extra bite of a gummy? And we're talking about size here. Um, these have 10 milligrams, and if you want to look at the size we're talking about, that's not a that's not an oversized gummy by any means. Um, now, if you're talking about 20 milligram gummy, we're looking. You got it's a little bigger. That's one 20 milligram gummy. Now, a 24 milligram sucker, even a little bigger. All of these things are available on my website. Um, this is my main focus right now. So if you order something, I'm going to ship it out immediately. So order some, everything's ready to go on the website. I got gummies that are 10 milligrams a piece, exact same THC type as dispensary selling at the dispensary for $36 selling at my website for $15 suckers that are 24 milligrams. I'm selling packs of five. Um, also like, uh, 16 bucks. Some of the Delta Stars. All this is Delta 9. This is not Delta 8. Um, this is not Delta 10. This is not synthetics THC. This is not fake stuff. This is all regular Delta 9 that you would get at your dispensary. The same THC that you've been smoking for the last 30 years or however long, 50 years, um, that you've grown up with all your life. All right, guys. Website, legal-thc-delta9.com. I have everything listed there. Pretty small store, but I really only want to sell what 
what the good shit is, basically. And right now, I think that's Delta 9. Delta 9 is the true the true weed, and the fact that we can get this now in Indiana at half the price of a dispensary shipped to your door is insane, and I want everyone to know about it. Anyone that has a medical condition that, that needs THC, that needs marijuana, it's ridiculous to go without it. We need to let everyone know if you know anybody that needs marijuana for any sort of medical thing, send them to the website legal-thc-delta9.com. Thanks, guys. Have a great day.